Welcome to the MVFC Extra Point. Valley teams make up three of the 11 national unbeatens. North Dakota State, South Dakota State, and SIU still perfect three games in. With nine of the 12 teams on bye weeks, Saturday will mean a light schedule for the league. It's the year of the quarterback in the Valley and nobody has been more accurate so far than North Dakota State signal caller Cam Miller. Coming off an 18 for 19 completion performance with 200 yards and two touchdowns, Miller set a Bison single game record for passers with a 94.7% completion rate in the win over Central Arkansas. He currently leads the FCS in completion percentage, but four other league quarterbacks sit in the top 12, all with completion percentages above 68%. The Valley season record is 75.2% set by UNI's Eric Sanders back in 2007. The feel-good story of the week features South Dakota running back Nate Thomas and the 15-month journey he's waged to get back on the field following a devastating knee injury. I got a medial and lateral meniscus tear and I ruptured my ACL and then I pretty much sprained LCL, PCL, and the MCL. Thomas missed all of last season rehabbing his right knee and said the time spent watching from the sideline was reassurance how much he truly loved the game. I told myself I will, I'm going to remember this feeling that I have on the sideline and how bad I want to be out there. Once I come back, if I can carry this feeling with me, once I step on the field again, then it's going to change like everything about the game for me. Thomas says his endurance has improved and last week teamed up with Travis Tice in the backfield for 305 yards rushing in a Coyotes win, setting a new career high in the process with 164 yards rushing and two touchdowns. I just know I'm playing for something bigger than myself out there. And so like really it's more of showing people like, hey, just whatever you're going through, man, just put your head down and work hard. Speaking of working hard, the Coyote defense has been doing work the last two games and hasn't allowed a score in eight quarters. South Dakota currently is surrendering just 13.7 points per game to rank in the top eight of the FCS.